Well guys, parts of Sebastian County are still dealing with the effects from that cold weather. Today I caught up with one of the local water districts and found out what is wrong with the water and why certain parts of the county are still under boil orders. We had, you know, freeze ups at meters and they've been bursting and uh, uh, the loss of water through them. Uh, we're just having a hard time uh, keeping water in a certain area right now. Especially the water suppliers. We got one tank that's, you know, completely out of water. Boil orders continue to be in place for parts of Sebastian County. We have got some water going back in that area today, so uh, uh, we're still trying to uh, uh, solve that problem down there. Including the Sugarloaf area and parts of Hackett. You know, we've gone through spell, uh, cold spells before, but uh, this one was seem it was different. Something that the James Fork Water District has never seen before. We're out working right now trying to uh, get everybody back in water. We're trying different things that we had never had to do before. With help from the county, cities continue to wait on water. Uh, I've contacted the emergency management out of Fort Smith and they're, uh, they call them water buffaloes. Uh, they're hauling water to the Sugarloaf area and uh, uh, south of the Hackett area. The district says that they hope to have things back to normal in the next couple of days throughout the county, but they wanted to add that they have been saying that for the last week, so they are unsure of the timetable to get everything back to normal. Reporting in Sebastian County, Jacob Murphy, 4029 News.